So you want to speed up your pictures on your WordPress website. This is just a quick video, simple video on how to use a cache plugin. This I'm using WP Super Cache and a CDN, a content delivery network. I'm using Bunny CDN. Uh, hang on and I'll show you my configuration. I'm not an expert, but this is what it's working for me. So you um, already have Bunny CDN. I'm not going to explain how to open an account. Um, pretty much, you add a pull zone. I clicked on Add a Pull Zone. Uh, I'm just going to name my site my site, and I'm just basically making this so that you guys can see this. And basically, what you do is. Uh, your site or whatever. My, I'm gonna put your my site, and then I'm gonna create a. This is my website. Your my site. Obviously, this is not a real domain. It's just basically so I can show you what you, uh, the way it needs to be set up. I'm gonna add the pull zone. And um, uh, Bunny CDN has a WordPress plugin. I installed it. I, I guess it works, but I don't know. But it didn't work for me. Maybe it needs to just replicate. And um, I didn't just have the time to wait. But um, this is this is the uh, the way it worked for me. Real quick, I installed the WP Cache uh, the plugin. And this is all this is all you need. I'm gonna pause the video so I can go into into my settings and then um, and, and make this the, uh, the the configuration so that you can see it okay so this is the way it's working for me once I created that pull zone all I did was copy the uh, original URL which is your sure my site.com whatever your website is go into your uh, CDN settings on WP um, WP Super Cache settings. Go to CDN, enable CDN, and paste your uh, website URL. Just your website URL, simple. Then you're gonna copy this. You're gonna copy this, um, and you're gonna paste it in here. Now quick a quick uh, thing if you want to do your own CDN where you don't want people to know that you're using bunny CDN or you want to make it look nice you want to make it look nice um, what you do is you add a uh, you know you create a C name you create a C name your your my site.com and you add it now you have to go into uh, whoever your DNS provider is and add a C name. You add a C name, CDN, and then you add this information to the C to the C name, and you make that uh, a, a C name. That's up to you. Um, but right now, just for the video, um, another thing I want to do is I want to force uh, SSL. Basically, most uh, if you have an SSL website it will not work if you don't do this so once you're here I just want to show you what you need to do uh, on the CDN side of WP super cache now it works with W3 super uh, W3 cache plugin it works with other plugins this is what I use um, uh, if anybody else wants to make a video on the way it's uh, there's a lot of uh, videos on W3 cache uh, plug-in I don't use it so you know maybe watch those videos if you have if you use that plugin and you understand it but I understand WP super cash this is what I've been using for years so um, pretty much this is my configuration uh, this needs to be caching needs to be on and um, let me go into events and show you what I have selected uh, maybe it will work for some of you this is a working website so uh, it is working for me uh, enable caching 
I have simple. Uh, this is what I have enabled. If you want to uh, copy my settings, my settings work. Uh, this is pretty much what I have. I don't mess around with anything else. I don't know how, and I'm just showing you the CDN stuff that um, that works for me. So uh, that's it, pretty much. Uh, it, it's all. It's all once once you do that, any pictures that show up on your website are gonna be served over the uh, Bunny CDN. And if you had the CDN uh, C name, the uh, it will it will go to that when when you click on the picture, that picture will be served over the Bunny CDN. Right now, it'll just if somebody looks at the picture, it's gonna come from uh, this this domain cdn.net so um i hope this video helps somebody and it's just a basically a reference on on what i do and the way it works for me uh, i tried using the bunny cdn plugin it didn't work maybe i didn't wait enough but with the wp super cash plugin it started working right away uh, i could test pictures and they get served over the uh, cdn right away so this is the way it works for me um, if you have a better way or you know maybe you see something wrong leave it in the comments and basically we will all learn have a great day guys and I'll see you on the next